गुड इवनिंग एवरी वन एज यू नो दस एज ए गुड प्रोडक्ट इन दिस इन दोप सिस्टम एज यू टॉक अबाउट लो जी आई और यू टॉक अबाउट अपर जी आई नाउ टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू डेमोस्ट्रेट वन ए गुड सिस्टम लॉन्च बाई ओलम्पस लास्ट इयर इट इज कॉल्ड सी बी वन सेवेंटी सिस्टम इंक्लूडिंग बहुत लाइन स्टोर एंड इन इंग्लिश प्रोसेसर इन वन सिस्टम स्कोपेंट इज taking of the care uh, taking by the scope so always you should be care of taking care of handling of the scopes now uh, i come to here this up to here i have the 21 inch iso medical grade monitor number 1 number 2 i am having a cb170 uh, octera model octera octera model and the here uh, i have the monitors and you can see all things are beautifully connected unfortunately i don't have the uh, stands otherwise you can get it in a good stand Having top to bottom and uh, with the arm you can keep your uh, scope over there. Which lamp we use here? Sorry. Not the model. Which lamp? Lamp. It is uh, using a LED. Okay. LED lamp. LED. And the feature of uh, you uh, remember the good thing. If the feature of the LED is earlier we would be using the halogen, then we come to a general lamp. And nowadays okay. we are having the uh, LED lamp without uh, without a light. This uh, doesn't long, have long the lasting. Long. It is a too much long lasting. It is just like the boards of this. It's just like the keyboard. It's just like these things. It don't have a lamp like. So you can see the no lamp like over here. So this is the combined processor and light source. Yeah, right? this is the actually combined, combined processor of the light source. Mm -hmm. uh, this is the new concept. Very this good. this was launched last year by the Orum. Okay. okay. Uh -huh. Now here I I gonna start with the scopes. The mm -hmm. system is off. System is down. Mm -hmm. Every time you connect the scopes, you should um, turn off the uh, switch of the scope. Okay. For grabbing it, you should always take your both hands. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and you should take it care carefully okay first grab the connector with your one hand okay then grab the light connector with your another hand mm -hmm. but separate this with your one finger okay mm -hmm. keep it like this so that you will not get any contact on this one okay mm -hmm. and before connecting this uh, to the system you should ensure that these electronics are not wet mm -hmm. okay mm -hmm. otherwise it will destroy your electronics and uh, this is a uh, uh, what you can say water resist you can keep it Anyway, you like, you can drop it to the water. Okay. Mm -hmm. Third, I'm gonna pick up this thing. I'm gonna enroll it like this. Is this connector is waterproof? This is also waterproof. Okay. Okay. You can get the help of someone otherwise. So grab it from here and mm -hmm. put it like this. Always connect to this two in your one hand, this two in your one hand. Okay. Never bend this thing because this is having the uh, optical connection inside. Once you bend, you are losing a twenty thousand Singapore dollar. That is for sure. Okay. okay. And there is no warranty claim available. Mm -hmm. Now here, always start with your light pipe. Okay, just see here. Push, finish, and look here. Here is the off. Mm. It's written over here. You just push it like this. Slowly. Do not apply any forces. And be sure that there is no bend. You you mm. you are not allowed to make any circles over here. Fine. Now I don't have the stand for this one, so uh, Dwarika will help me to get the stand. Make it height. Now always remember your this tip. distal yeah, end distal yeah distal end never going to touch any surface any time never ever once you touch your lens gets scratched mm -hmm. then you are losing 5000 dollar good mm -hmm. okay grab it now <coughs> i going to come i am coming to the system cv 170 system mm -hmm. i going to switch it on okay okay this is you you have before Yeah, I am come to one by one. Okay. Now the system I have switched it on. I just forget the monitor just now. Mm -hmm. Then come down to come down to the uh, processor or why, what we can do the system. I mm will -hmm. start from the left. Here you have the tube. You have the can. This is having the internal uh, pressure uh, internalized pressure chamber, for which you will pressurize the air inside and you will get a pressurized water outside. And through the scopes, it will go up to the distal end. Okay, so you don't need a, any external pressure. We ha I have the internal diaphragm, ear diaphragm, which will create the ear pressure. My ear pressure will insert from here, from one hole, and that will press 
keep pressing my water. That will give a pressure to the uh, to my bottled water so that the pressurized water come inside. And here, this connection, this water chamber is directly coming to my distal meter. And this is controlled by the one mechanical switch in between. Okay, so that it's a clear lid. So you need to fill the water up to here, mm -hmm. and you can keep it over there like this. And to connect this over here, you should have a little bit tricky. You have to go in a straight, little bit bend, like this, and put it inside. This is locked, okay? If you have the vacuum, vacuum is going over here. Okay. And these remaining things are, it is for a cleaning purpose, okay? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> then I am coming to the, these two ports. Upper ports is the digital ports, which is uh, take out the signal mm -hmm. and uh, receive the signals of the digital uh, my process image. And downside, you can see the two connectors. One is for a light and one is for the yes. Mm -hmm. And including the controlling electronics is also there. For this system, you can see some electronics over here, mm -hmm. which, is, which is used to di uh, identify the probes also. This is what uh, scope I am using, it is used for uh, identification also. Okay, now I am coming to the menu. In the menu, I do have the menu where this menu is for processing systems. You can get it inside and uh, four uh, keys. This is for the menu processing and the iris, I have uh, two options. One is peak and one is the in. Peak iris means uh, iris means just uh, like the lens of your eyes. If there is low light, you have to open it more to get a good image. Okay. If there is a high light, light zyada out of it, you can do it smaller. You can make it smaller so that uh, it will be make the image better. Mm -hmm. Now, another channel is a ear channel, uh, which is showing a high and low. Okay, mm -hmm. high yeah, is yeah. high is showing the high ear flow and low is showing the low ear flow. Okay, so you can start the pump like this. Look, this pump is started. Good. This is, you can control the air flow from here. Okay, then next I have the NBI. NBI is a narrow band imaging and uh, which uh, help us to find out your capillaries and arteries of the mucosal surface or the any areas of your skins. And uh, I do have the last one is, the, last one is the lamp. Lamp, uh, I'm, I already told you that I do have the lamp of the LED, which doesn't have its lamp light. And this is the good thing uh, we came with the 170 system. Okay, you don't have the lamp light. And you do have the clear vision also light. I'll demonstrate you later on. And coming down, you do have the brightness. I do have the two modes of the brightness, mm -hmm. auto and the uh, uh, manual. Even in a auto, even in a manual, you can manually uh, adjust the brightness, okay? And down, I have the two, we have given the two MBs of uh, memory for the, uh, with the system. For this, you can do the uh, settings. You can cap cap capture the images for the system. And for this system, no video capture is possible with the system. You have to either get a DVD recorder external or you have to connect it with the PC. Mm -hmm. Okay. And the uh, last one, I do have the Hoyt Valens. Okay. Uh, Hoyt Valens is a, uh, just you know the calibrating the, uh, my uh, wavelength of the lights. Mm -hmm. uh, so I got to start it. Okay. This is the ESO 21 inch uh, monitor grade, uh, sorry, medical grade monitor. The good brand one. Here it is the Olympus uh, standard keyboard, portrait keyboard. Here I do have the Hoyt Valens kit. And the system is uh, normally connected and you are getting the SD video, full SD video over here. Now what you are getting. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now I am going to start the system. System has already switched on. So I gonna, I just want to give a, is a start the light one. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now you can see the, some movements in the light, friction of the lights. And which gonna stable. Because the system is in auto mode. Mm -hmm. So it is calculating how much light to give. Mm -hmm. Fine. Now I am changing it to a manual mode. I'm just decreasing it. Have you captured something? Okay. Here. Yeah. Yeah. Now here you are uh, having a two uh, sets of uh, uh, light uh, uh, educating, and uh, both are coming up to here from the optical channels. We don't have the. Uh, connection in between so you are getting the two different uh, isolated optical channels up to here and you are getting the one uh, nozzle uh, just to make the spring and you are getting the one suction channel also uh, that suction channel will work uh, uh, for the insertion channel also and which you can uh, uh, calculate it from over here okay just get it and I'm coming to the scope here you are getting the uh, four switches four switches you can assign it for uh, different purposes you can uh, just like the for NBI mode, just to record, just to free, just to zoom. You can uh, assign the four scopes for uh, any works. And uh, I do have the two. One is for uh, uh, that one. Uh, this is one is for a spray and one is for a suction. This is for a uh, air, air spray. So that my motor is always moving, always running. 
and this here is going on. If I make an obstacle over here, the 